Right here, we got a 2017 Chevrolet Tahoe, and I'm gonna show you how to change the gold badge on that steering wheel into a nice dark satin. Well, the black factory ones, you know, the ones that look a lot better. And I have an overlay that I found about 25 bucks on eBay, paste right on top of the factory one. Guess there's no easy way to take off the factory one, and it's easier just paste on top of this one. It will give the ride a lot more quality of a look upgraded appearance however the dimensions of the logo is the same on the silverado also the cruise i believe the malibu and the whole chevy lineup around 2015 and 2019 probably 2020 and beyond could be the same concept same method if you can get the overlay that i have it's going to be an easy install here in the interior let me do it all in one go not sure all right step right up and take a seat now you can see down here it's still drying a little grab the the cleanest cotton cloth i could find and i just went around with some vinegar and a spray bottle and went around all the corners and edges and tried to take out any of that dirt and oil and, and spit bacteria and all that plastic when the sun beats down on it, it just rises up them chemicals you can see there's a bunch of hair and little plastic bits microfibers take some of that rubbing alk isopropyl alk got some here refill the bottle with some made from my still in the backyard and go around and just clean off all the oils because yeah the hands got millions trillions but billions of bacteria oh look at that come on where'd you go sure to get the middle and all the edges really dig down deep in there there's a lot of particles falling out of the nose going on there and really make sure it's all cleaned up with that isopropyl just dry that off with your handkerchief did the vinegar and water with the clean cloth cotton went over it with some isopropyl and now we're about ready for the overlay i'm just letting it dry and hopefully together we will be able to make Chevrolet have a black badge as standard instead of a gold. I know gold has always been the Chevy standard, you know, 50s, 60s, before, way before that. However, I think it's time to upgrade. I think all of the Chevy vehicles from now on, here on out, should either be full chrome, full black. I think Ford should do the same as well and get rid of the blue oval. And for good measure, I'm going to use a blower on the dust. <laughs> Like we're ready. Grab your overlay, open the bag, make sure to recycle this. I know many grocery stores recycle this plastic bags now. At least for the front and rear badges, the pull tab is always on the left. And there's no indication of whether which side is up or down. I'm just going to keep it on the left. I think it's identical. And I'm going to overlay that on top and it's going to hold in by glue. Make sure there ain't a speck of dust on. You hear me? The dust is going to be locked in there forever. I right, thought you'd do it. Got one chop. Line that up with some play to be had. Hmm. Hold up. I'm seeing some smudging. <sighs> now we mean business. Oh, it's hard to get it perfectly on there. It's a little shorter. Perhaps be a little longer on each side. want to push it on there. Just enough to three, two, one. Heat. Wishing it was green. The adhesive sticks on there because of the low, low temps of today. And with that being hot to the touch, I'd say it's a job well done.